Today I'm going to make some trees and some forests. Welcome back to I'm Bad at Gaming. I'm Ula, and today I'm going to show you how I make woods and trees. Uh, it's a bit like the uh, Saga woods, but uh, I'm going to use some different types of trees to do it. Uh, I hope you like it. If you like my videos, please like the video and subscribe to my channel. That would really help me a lot. Uh, for this uh, project, this is uh, for Bring a Battle Wargaming as well. So uh, let's get to it. So I started as usual with uh, the base. I got some templates for these kind of bases and I'll trace them out and then I'll cut them out. And for this project I need two bases of the same kind. So I'll trace out and cut out the other one as well. Then I'll drill uh, holes in them with a hole saw so I get uh, three bases as well. Then I'll scuff them up with uh, sandpaper. And then glue them down with super glue. And to make a nice edge on that, I'll uh, use a knife or you can use sandpaper as well to trim off the edge. Uh, when that has dried, I'll uh, use PVA glue and uh, cover the whole piece. Try to avoid the holes for this uh, part, and then I'll uh, pour on sand. Make sure I get the edges as well. Then I'll do the same for the trees, but this time I'll put in something in the hole so I don't cover the hole up. So down with the air glue, brush that out and pour on sand. In hindsight, I should have done this after I mounted the trees, uh, but uh, sometimes you're a bit eager. Then I use brown uh, paint for basing, and I'll paint the whole piece and also the tree bases as well. Now for the trees, I've got the different kinds of trees. These are just uh, cheap ones from Wish or uh, eBay. These ones come in uh, packets of 50s and they're quite cheap. And you just dab them in uh, PVA glue like this. You can use a brush and brush it on as well, but this works quite nice for these trees. And then just plant them in the uh, vat of uh, flock hair. This is uh, brushes, it's a bit coarser. For these ones I'll use spray glue, so I just spray the uh, tree down and then I'll just whisk them around in the vat there with uh, the brush flock. I'm going to use a couple of different types of trees and tree armatures and uh, a couple of different types of adhesives like uh, spray glue ordinary PVA and dip the trees or brush it on or spray on the adhesive and then I'll either uh, whisk them around a vat like I did before or like this I'll use a coarse turf and I'll just uh, put it on this to show you different kinds of techniques and uh, what would uh, suit you more
then I'll let them dry for a while and then I'll go in with the watered down PVA glue and spray them on well and then I pour on uh, some stir again and spray them down you can also uh, mix uh, water on PVA with uh, flow aid and just uh, dip the trees in this is a bit messier and you have to have a quite big vat to get the whole tree in as you can see here this is also water down PVA Now I'll use um, IPA and spray them down and then I'll use a uh, water down PVA in a sprayer bottle. This is to get the uh, water down PVA to seep in quite nice. And now I've got some bases here. To make them more heavy in the bottom I use uh, washers like this and I just super glue them down. And then I'll pour on PVA glue. Then I put on some sand. As you can see, there's quite a lot of PVA glue. So the uh, sand and PVA glue runs off. This makes a nice difference in the uh, bases. This is more like building up the differences in, in the bases. And when that has dried, I'll cut off the uh, protruding parts with a clipper or uh, you can use a blade or a knife. And then I'll just try them out. Uh, I'll have to baste them again. This is why you can do uh, either this from the beginning or uh, now. So then uh, on with the PVA glue on the bases. And now I'll pour PVA glue and brush it all over the uh, whole piece, even the holes. And then I'll use ground turf to cover the whole piece, make sure I get the edges. And I'll do the same for the trees now. Make sure the edges uh, gets covered as well. And then I'll press down the uh, flop. Then I go over the piece when it's dried with uh, IPA and uh, watered down PVA glue. So when the basis is dried, I use uh, IPA and watered down PVA glue. This time I'm going to sprinkle down some more flock as well. This is to make it the, the uh, ground a bit different and uh, bumpier. I just left it dry and pour off the excess. And then I go in with PVA glue and put down some uh, brushes and then uh, soak that with PVA glue and sprinkle on some flock uh, around the uh, brushes there and I'll do the same on the tree braces make sure I soak them uh, real good with water down PVA glue And then I'll spray them down again with IPA and water down PVA. I'll sprinkle some lighter flock here on the top. And then I'll just let them dry. And here is the finished result. I hope you like it. If you do, please like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any requests, please uh, leave a comment as well. And I hope you see you next time. Bye.